Stanford University. The leatherback turtle is, is uh, I like to think of the leatherback turtle as a superlative, uh, enigmatic reptile that um, a lot of uh, folks will call a living dinosaur. It uh, reaches weights nearing uh, 2,000 pounds, and from, from the tip of the beak to the, to the edge of the rear flippers uh, can reach over uh, nine feet in length. Today, leatherbacks are, um, in certain parts of the world, we're seeing some recoveries, but um, across the Pacific, uh, critically endangered. And the, the population in the Eastern Pacific, particularly in peril, with having experienced uh, declines of over uh, 90 percent in the last two decades. And most of the Eastern Pacific con uh, population is concentrated uh, on the beaches of Costa Rica, and particularly in northwestern Costa Rica, uh, Guanacaste and, um, and Playa Grande. And that's where we did all of our tagging work. So we put out 46 total tags over three tracking seasons. We tagged in 2004, 2005, and 2007. We had turtles that traveled as far as 4,000 miles from the nesting beach out way out into pelagic realms in the South Pacific gyre. Uh, we also identified some e extraordinary, uh, extraordinarily deep dives and long dives uh, with one dive of over a thousand meters that lasted more than uh, 80 minutes in duration, which is one of the world's longest ever and deepest ever um, dives for a leatherback turtle. After they leave the inner nesting environment and head out into the open ocean, they move in a concerted way through an area that has intensive commercial fishing pressure, and that is the region between the coast of Costa Rica and south of the Galapagos Islands. But the target, of course, um, are, are, are fish, and turtles happen to be unfortunate um, victims along the way. And we're hoping that the data that we're generating through these studies will help uh, to inform better practice, practices in fisheries. Uh, we might advise fishermen that they should set their hooks lower or higher or at different depths during day versus night, uh, for example. We've, we've seen declines from 1,500 or so females in the 1980s all the way to about 50 or so or even less uh, today. Although the numbers suggest that things um, are are headed towards a, a, a grim outcome. I think that there's still time to save leatherbacks in the Eastern Pacific, but I buttress that remark with the need to be ever vigilant about protection of those nesting beaches that remain. And you can only think to yourself uh, when you see these animals give birth and the efforts they, um, they exert to do that. Uh, wow, we really have an obligation uh, to protect them. For more, please visit us at stanford.edu.